Welcome back. Please share, subscribe, and comment. Canada, Tottenham title. The search for home. The Tottenham quest in the lush, whispering outskirts of Toronto, nestled between vibrant neighborhoods and tranquil parks, lay the community of Tottenham, Ontario. Once a quiet hamlet, Tottenham had morphed into a mosaic of cultures and stories, all under the watchful gaze of the glorious Canadian sky. But what drew so many people to this corner of the world? What secrets lay beneath its surface, prompting families to search for solace within its bounds? Maya, a recent Canadian immigrant from India, had always dreamed of living in a place that felt like home. Arriving in Toronto with her husband, Ravi, and their toddler, Anaya, the couple faced a reality of city life that was overwhelming. The cacophony of metropolitan life drowned out their hopes for a close-knit community, an escape from the frenetic pace of urban living. One winter afternoon, while sipping her aromatic masala chai and scrolling through social media, Maya stumbled upon a post about Tottenham, a nostalgic picture depicting quaint houses adorned with twinkling lights, families playing in the sunshine, and vast open spaces. Curiosity peaked, Maya started her search for Tottenham. As she delved deeper, she uncovered layers of history, strong community ties, and a way of life that echoed the simplicity she yearned for. She learned about the town's origins, how it began as a farming community and evolved into a suburban oasis peppered with rich Canadian heritage. This narrative resonated with her. Having roots in a tightly woven family fabric back in India, she craved a similar experience in her new homeland. Ravi, a passionate artist, joined her in exploring what life in Tottenham could mean for them. They envisioned a home where Anaya could play outside freely, ride her bicycle down tree-lined streets, and forge lifelong friendships just as they had in their childhoods. As the couple discussed their dreams, they discovered an unexpected connection among other newcomers and longtime residents. Everyone seemed to be searching for something beyond just a physical space. They were seeking community, identity, and a place to belong. Maya took to social media, joining local forums and groups, eager to communicate with other prospective residents. To her surprise, she discovered an influx of diverse families coming to Tottenham. Refugees, newcomers, and seasoned Canadians alike, all drawn by the promise of a nurturing environment where dreams took root. Many shared their stories. People fleeing conflict, professionals seeking affordable housing, and families desiring a slower pace. They spoke of friendly neighbors, shared festivals, and the charm of local markets where fresh produce was only a handshake away. As Maya and Ravi began their house hunting journey, they attended community events to get a feel for this vibrant tapestry. Through barbecues in neighborhood parks, farmers markets bursting with local flavor, and cultural celebrations that brought together the old and new, they witnessed the magic of a community that not only accepted them, but embraced them wholeheartedly. One crisp autumn day, a playful breeze ushered in the vibrant colors of fall as Maya wandered through the streets of Tottenham, hand in hand with Anaya. She paused to admire an old maple tree, its golden leaves glistening like tiny jewels against the cerulean sky. In that moment, she felt an overwhelming sense of peace, a feeling she had been searching for since she arrived in Canada. This wasn't just land or buildings. It was a weave of dreams, aspirations, and stories that mirrored her own. Emboldened by her experiences, Maya decided to host a multicultural potluck for the newcomers of Tottenham. She invited everyone to bring a dish representing their heritage, bridging cultures through the power of food and shared experiences. On the day of the event, the community came alive. Tables overflowed with biryani, sushi, tamales, and pies. Laughter filled the air while children played tag across the lawn. Through their shared stories and culinary treasures, Maya realized that Tottenham was not just a place to live, but a sanctuary for those in search of belonging and hope. As months passed, Maya and Ravi finally found a home, a charming house with a little garden where they could grow their spices alongside common Canadian flowers. They painted their new lives with vibrant colors, nurturing relationships that fostered a sense of family and belonging. In a land known for its vast spaces and opportunities, they discovered that the heart of Canada was not just in the landscapes, but in the people who called it home. 
In the ever-evolving narrative of Tottenham, the reason for the search was more profound than merely a location. It was about finding community, love, and deep connections. It was about creating a life steeped in warmth, laughter, and the promise of a future woven together through shared dreams. And as they watched Anaya grow amidst friends of different backgrounds, Maya and Ravi knew they had woven their own small thread into the beautiful tapestry of this cherished community.